Hello, I'm just dropping by to show you how I created a desktop desktop organizer. I shared this on Instagram and I got a few requests to make a tutorial for it. So here we go. Um, I did want to say that there's probably way easier ways to do this, but this is just how I happen to do it. So let me show you how I put it together. First of all, um, this is what it's going to look like in the end. So let me go ahead and get out of that. You need to find out what your screen resolution is. Um, I'm working with an Apple computer, so I'm going to go to System Preferences. That's going to bring up a screen like this. I will then go to the Displays, and it's going to tell me how large my screen is. So I'm going to write this measurement down so that I can use it to convert it to inches. So now that I have that measurement, I'm going to go into Photoshop. And I'm sure you can use other things as well, but I just happen to have Photoshop, so I just use that. I drag any clip art that I have onto it. Then I'm going to go up here to Image, Canvas Size, and I'm going to write Pixels here. And I'm going to write those measurements down that I got before. Hit OK and proceed. Now this is how large your screen is. Those are the dimensions. So now I need to find out how many inches it is so that I can put that into uh, PowerPoint. So I go up here to image, then image size. Now these are your measurements that you're going to need. So you write those down, 12.8 and 7.2 inches. So I'm going to put OK here. Then I can get out of Photoshop because I don't need it anymore. Now I will go over to PowerPoint. Hold on one second, let me resize it so it fits in the screen. Okay, now you will go over to File and Page Setup. And you're going to enter those measurements. So 12.80 and 7.2. Click OK and then here just click OK. Now that you're here, you can go ahead and design it. So just drag your clipboard onto it, whatever else you want on it, and um, you'll be good to go. Let me show you what mine looks like here. Okay, so I designed mine. And these are just a bunch of boxes, as you can see, that I made, and my text boxes, my clip art. So that's all I did to it. Now, here's a little trick. If you did it right, if you click on Slideshow here, it should fill up your whole screen, just like that. Now, you can't see my whole screen, but I'm looking at my screen here, and it covers the edges nicely. It's not too tall up here. It's not too low down here, so it's perfect. So that tells me that it's going to fit my screen nicely. So now I'm going to go over to save. I'm going to click save as. Now I'm going to go to PNG and make sure that you have it saved on dots per inch. Save it to 300 dpi so you have really sharp images and make sure that it says best down here so that you have the best quality. And click OK. Now, I already have one that's named this, so I'm going to name this 2 and save it. I can now get out of this one. And, oh, it saved it to, it should save it to your desktop, but it ended up saving mine to a folder that I had here. So this is what it's going to look like. Now, if you open it up, you see it right there. It won't be the actual size, but you can take a quick preview of it. Now when you go here, you're just going to right click it, let me make it higher so you can see the bottom of it. You're going to right click it here, see how my mouse is acting up, then set desktop picture and that's it. Now mine was already like that so you didn't see any change but let's say I had one here that I made some mistakes on and I didn't like it so let's say you change it back to that one. There it is. So I, first of all, I spelled clip art wrong, 
and it's too tall up here so I went back and redid it and um, I needed more more um, spaces over here so I just right click it again set the desktop and there you go that's pretty much it so uh, like I said it's not difficult um, it seems to be a lot of steps but like I said I'm sure there's a way easier way to do it but that is how I made mine so um, I hope you have fun making your desktop organizers. Thank you.